It's your favorite local, especially after I done spoke. Support the real, get rid of the fake. How do you do that? All you got to do, hold on, the F you to the industry. How do you do that? Just subscribe, bro. Then follow me on Instagram at C-E-D-D-Y-N-A-S-H, one word. I do follow back. What's up with the visionaries? Famous Dex came home after a month. I'm kicking it in rehab. I'm sorry, that's too soon. The 30-day theory to learn anything is just a theory. It's not proven fact. I think little buddy should have stayed in there for at least, at least three months. And I'm going to tell you why. To create a new normal and sustain a new normal is some of the hardest things to do ever. That's why you see some people when they lose weight, they gain it all back. Because they'll go on these ridiculous diets that they can't sustain. They'll do these things that are infathomable. I don't even know if that's a word, but whatever. I like the way it sounds, so screw you. But, little buddy still looks sick, man. I'm sorry, he still looked the same like he did when he came in, when he went in. Coming out, you looking like you exactly did. And I get it, he got all the tattoos, he got that face. Like, I, I, I get all that, and I'm not making fun of him for that. That's just what it is. Somebody be like, well, Naz, you a six foot two big black dude looking like, I don't know, the, a grizzly bear fresh out of the wild. I, I'll take that. That's cool. I ain't mad at you. If you got funny jokes and you said it against me, bro, I'm not going to front. This is funny as hell. One dude dissed me was like, yo, Sadie Nash, you, you look like a BBW. I ain't going to lie because I ain't heard nothing that funny in my life well, for a, a while. But still, the facts still remain, all jokes aside. Somebody need to monitor little buddy for real, for real. One of the things that's happening with the industry right now is there are a lot of artists who are making money without the labels and don't need them. One of the things that the label, some labels do is they safeguard you, meaning they'll have security with you and stuff like that. And they'll kind of keep track of you and stuff like that. And they'll talk to you through money terms. So they'll do something like, hey, you know, if you do this and do that, here's an extra incentive in your contract. Now you think it to yourself like, should I do this? Should I do that? Or should I go pick up that extra 50000 You're going to want that 50000 I don't care what nobody say. I want that 50000 But yeah, man, little buddy still look terrible, man. I, I just, I I pray for that. You know, I I, I pray for healing for the nation. I'm going I'm to keep it real. Y'all want to know what my prayer is? Go ahead and let me know in the comments and stuff like that. And I'll write it out for y'all and stuff like that. But other than that, man, I... I I don't want to see no youngins like that go out because I know they employ a lot of people and they take care of a lot of people. You don't want to wish nothing bad on nobody. And I'm not wishing bad on nobody. I hope that his recovery is full, that he get at least three T-bone stakes in him at least twice a week. That That's just me. I, I really hope that he get like some big meals in him because little buddy looked like he weighed 110 pounds. I don't know how tall he is or nothing like that or anything. But what I will tell you is... He don't look like he healthy all the way. And that's one of my issues. So, yeah, man. Y'all expect me to keep it real because you know that I will. I do this daily, baby.